Protein, digestibility, corrected amino acid score. This is part three. We've talked a ton about this topic. Should you be concerned with the score? The majority of diet should be single ingredient foods. Things like beef, eggs, black beans. If you are doing that, you can be less concerned about the score. If you are hitting your protein goal each and every single day, you can be less concerned about the score. My coaching clients, I tell them that 80% or greater of their diet should be single ingredient foods. I give them a goal of 0.8 times their body weight protein each and every single day. As long as they are doing these things, things, they don't need to be concerned about the PDCAA score. However, if you're struggling to hit your protein goal every single day, you're not even getting 0.8 times your body weight in protein, and you are using things like Kodiak cakes or Built Puffs, then you should absolutely be concerned about the score. The reality is wheat protein has a score of 0.8 Four, as compared to something like beef that has a score of 0.92. Puff bars, which have collagen in it, collagen has a score of zero, whereas Greek yogurt has a perfect score of one. So if most of your protein is coming from single ingredient foods as opposed to protein bars or protein chips, you do not need to be obsessed with the score.